I just watched episode 5 of Rick and Morty and before I review it, I will quickly review episode 4 since I didn't make review of that episode due to some issues. Issues being my own laziness. But if you are not interested in episode 4's review and came only to see episode 5's review, you can skip to this time mark. I understand I'm really late. Anyways, episode 4 was really a good one. It had some hilarious moments. What I liked about this episode was its concept. It's short classic Rick who would go to a war rather than make a small compromise. Every time things are about to get better, something goes wrong or Rick's ego gets in the way. It was called Night Family and I was watching a video where the creators and writers of the show were saying they wanted this episode to feel like a John Carpenter's movie. They wanted it to be scary and it did felt like that. The way some scenes took place, it felt like an old horror movie and how in one scene a night person blended in with morning persons. I would say they succeeded in their task. Overall a really good and well made episode. Now I will start the review of episode 5. It was simply the best and the funniest episode of this season. I of Thundara, give me suits beyond suits. Jerry assistant clothing, make up. It is called Final Dismissation, which is obviously a nod to Final Destination as the concept of the episode was similar to the franchise. Since I am a fan of Final Destination and I read the name of the episode before I started watching it, I was already really excited. In the episode, after Jerry finds a bizarre prediction in a fortune cookie, his paranoia kicks in that his fortune will come true. Rick decides to help Jerry after he discovers something fishy is going on with the fortune cookies predictions. This leads them to the secret headquarters that is distributing all these fortune cookies. And Rick and Jerry go against the organization. I mean Jerry was there too. He did protect Rick from the bullets or the right way to say it will be Rick gives Jerry to protect himself from the bullets. I really like this episode. The episodes focus on Rick and Jerry's adventures are always great and this one is no exception. The ending was so funny. I kinda felt bad for Jerry but it was really funny and they further develop Rick and Jerry's dynamic here. You should watch it if you haven't not already. Leave whatever you are doing and watch it. This one was really good episode just like episode 4 and I hope they will continue delivering great episodes like this. Next episode seems fun. It reminds me of Get Swifty and I hope it will be just as good. And with that, my rambling comes to an end. If you like the video, press the like button, subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.